Hello and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are doing part two of my Princess Polly haul. A lot of really, really cute items for spring to summertime. If you missed part one, definitely check it out after this video. But before I get into the full try on haul, be sure you take the time right now and subscribe. Also be sure to hit the notification bell to be notified every time I post. I post new videos every Thursday and Saturday. And yeah. Let's jump into the haul. All right, so first off, we're starting with one of my favorite kind of items at Princess Polly, which is a two-piece set. And I'll just show you guys the two-piece set. So here are the two pieces. Um, it kind of looks like nothing, but I promise on, it looks really, really cute. So here is the top. And this, again, doesn't look like a top yet, but it will. It has this little zipper in the back which I'll just zip up and show you guys so you have this little zipper um it's looking more like a top now and this is the top it has this cute little crisscross detail and then kind of this little open keyhole thing going on so there's like a little cutout at the bottom and it's just, just really pretty whimsical little top it is quite cropped a lot of times I do obviously love wearing two-piece sets on their own but I will be kind of warning for this one this is a very cropped crop style so if you are pairing it with something else other than the skirt it comes with I would recommend it being high-waisted or something like that just being aware that this is quite like a cropped crop top but I feel like that also makes it perfect for summertime because the crop top with some cute high-waisted shorts I feel like is such a fun look and just a really simple outfit formula so I feel like this could be a really great building block for a lot of different outfits and not just simply part of the two-piece set it's also just in white so it's pretty neutral and will go with a lot of different things if you want to pair this with something that has a little pop of color that's also really fun but yeah so this is a little top for the two-piece set and then the bottoms on here are honestly what drew me towards this set in the first place similar to my last video I was looking for a cute little cropped cotton white skirt which I did indeed find so if you're looking for one of those two check out my other video but this time I was looking for one that was more of a maxi midi kind of style and this is like the perfect skirt in my opinion it is everything i was looking for so here it is it has these really fun almost like bubbly tears it's not actually tiered where it has layers hanging over but it has kind of these little stitching lines which is really cute and just adds i feel like a little bit of interest to the skirt doesn't make it as plain and simple it really gives a fun style to it and especially paired with the top i think it is such a cute set and like such a perfect spring summertime look as just so effortless and girly and whimsical and just such a pretty pretty set and this skirt similar to the top i feel like is also a great building block for so many different outfits there's so so many different ways you can style it i was actually talking to one of my friends recently about trying to style a maxi midi skirt this way so if you guys want to see that video i have some ideas she actually was a little bit nervous to purchase a skirt like this because she had no idea how to style it so if you fall in that boat let me know in the comments below i would love to do a full video styling a skirt like this in different ways but yeah it is quite versatile also can go really well between seasons and i love the length on this one i am wearing this set in let me double check the sizing. Yes, I'm wearing this set in a size two, and I have mentioned before in my Princess Polly hauls that the sizing can sometimes be a little bit tricky. Some things can run on the smaller side while other things run a little bit more true to size. I will say this one is more on that true to size sizing. I think the size two is perfect. It is quite stretchy of a skirt, so sometimes these elastic waists are not as stretchy as they may appear this one is quite stretchy of a style and the top has kind of that accordion -y, i don't know how to explain this kind of like scrunchy fabric so it does have some stretch to it as well it also has these little like stickier parts on the top so that kind of helps the strapless pieces 
stay up. This one also did come with straps when I got it. So there are little hooks for you to like hook and strap to if you do want to make this a strapped look. So there's like a little fabric hook that you can hook it to in the front and back here on the back. It just gives a little bit of a different look if you add the straps to it. Also like a fun way to kind of transform the top. So if you wear it with a two-piece set strapless, but then on its own with a pair of shorts or jeans where you wear it with a strap, it's like a whole new top. Um, so a lot of ways you can get different uses out of it. Also, the way that this is styled, where it is a cute, fun set, but the fact that it is more of that cotton soft material, you can really easily dress it up and dress it down. You can pair it with some fun wedges, some cool heels, and you can make it a lot more dressy. Or you can just wear it with like sneakers or flats or sandals and have it a little bit more casual. So there is a lot of ways you can dress it up, dress it down, and kind of get even more uses out of it. So yeah, overall I think this set is so, so cute and I'm so so excited to wear it this spring and summertime. All right, and then next up in the haul, I feel like I couldn't go to Princess Polly without getting a cute workwear item. Here it is. I have those super cute blazers. So I kind of fell in love with their blazers in my last haul. I got a black blazer from them and it was just the perfect oversized blazer. It is so 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 cute and actually quite flattering so I had to grab another one and this time in a tan color which I think is perfect for spring to summer time like it is such a nice color for the season I think it goes honestly really well with the rest of my workwear wardrobe it is quite neutral so it's easy to pair with a lot of different things also looks nice with some pops of color looks good with florals kind of all those things that you would think about wearing in spring to summertime and not just for workwear I feel like this is super cute as a layering piece just for everyday wear just in everyday outfits. I will say though, it is a little bit heavier. So this is thick, nice, good quality blazer. So it might not be the best once we get like deep into summer where it's a lot more warm out. Um, but for now, for springtime, for the June gloom, I think this is perfect. And I am wearing this one in a size two. This one is definitely an oversized style, so you can get away with a lot of different sizes in it, just depending on how oversized you want it to look or if you want it to look a little bit less oversized. So there's a lot of variety, I feel like, in the sizing that makes it a little bit easier if you're worried about the size of it. You really can't go wrong. But yeah, I am wearing this one in a size 2 and I think the fit is perfect. I also love the way you can kind of roll up the sleeves, wear them down, dress this up, make it more casual. Like there are actually so so many different ways you can style a blazer like this. I actually did a full video on styling the black blazer that I got from Princess Polly. So if you want some blazer outfit ideas, definitely check out that video after this one. Um, but yeah, overall this blazer is so so nice. So Super, super great quality and just the perfect color for that, again, spring to summer transition season. And it just makes a lot of cute little spring to summer outfits. All right, next up, we are again going back to some basics and here it is. So I feel like this is one of the best basics to have in your wardrobe, which is a t-shirt maxi dress. And I feel like this is so versatile. There are so, so many different ways you can dress it up, dress it down. It makes a great base for an outfit as well. And the fact that it's a little bit different, like having that maxi t-shirt dress style, it's just really fun and kind of funky and it can be just a great way to incorporate something that is simple but still can be very stylized into your looks. I am wearing this one in a size 2 and I think the fit is perfect. It is quite like stretchy of a dress so I would say you could probably get away with multiple sizings in it. I feel like for the look that I want I do like it very fitted. I feel like that is probably the most flattering for me so I did size true to size on this one but I could definitely get away with a size 4 or going up even to a size 6 because it is like so stretchy and just kind of can give a different look if you want a little bit more baggy versus fitted. I also love the color on this 
this one. I don't have a lot of gray in my wardrobe and I've been trying to incorporate a few more pieces just because I feel like it's a forgotten neutral. Like it is actually quite a neutral color, but a lot of times people just gravitate towards the black, white, and beige and they forget about gray. So I feel like gray needs a little bit more recognition in the neutral category and it actually pulls together really well with tan and black and white yeah i just feel like there are so so many different ways you can style this this dress in particular i love it has a little slit in the back which you know me on my maxi dresses i love a good slit i hate the feeling of being too claustrophobic just depending on the style especially for like a clingy stretchy dress having the little slit just gives a little bit of breathing room but obviously for other styles i think no slit makes sense but for this one, we love the little slit in the back. And yeah, I think this is such a nice basic to add to your wardrobe. It is a little bit lighter of like a fabric material. So even though it is a maxi length, it will work really well in spring and summertime, even when it gets a little bit hotter. Also a great way to dress it up, dress it down, put it with wedges, wear it with sandals, with sneakers. Like there are so, so many different ways you can style this and it look really, really cute and fun for the season. But yeah, overall I find this dress to be the perfect basic to add to your spring and summer wardrobe. All right, and last but definitely not least, the item that I was probably the most excited for to arrive from this haul. So let me just show you guys here here she is um this dress is absolutely stunning like I'm blown away by this dress it is so so beautiful and just the perfect like spring summer garden party kind of style dress which I do have some weddings coming up and so I was looking for a formal dress to wear to my spring summertime weddings and this is like absolutely perfect it is so so cute and so beautiful and flattering like all the amazing things so I was nervous about the style when I saw it online I'm like is it gonna be as cute in person is it gonna be a total fail and it is a such a win I'll give you guys a little close-up on some of the detailing here but it has these kind of like embroidered flowers along the top of it and also goes up onto the strap but it doesn't go fully across the strap which you might think at first would be a turnoff, but I actually love that feature because it means there is room for an adjustable strap. And you know me, I am the biggest fan of adjustable strap. I truly believe everything should have an adjustable strap and I love when I see it. So I was so excited that this had an adjustable strap on it and still had the beautiful styling. And then the rest of the dress really is just a nice maxi satin dress. It lays so beautifully. It does have the zipper in the back, which I think helps make it a lot more flattering. A lot of times satin dresses are kind of just slip dresses where you pull them on and there isn't anything that really can like cinch you in and give you shape because there's no zipper or ties or anything like that but this one does have the zipper in the back which I do find to be more flattering and gives a little bit more of a shape to the dress this one is also so soft like the material on this is so so nice and really really great quality I am wearing this dress in a size 2 and I think the fit is perfect again as I've said before Princess Polly sometimes is a little bit funky with the sizings and I was really nervous that the two is going to be too small but it actually fits so well so if you are in between sizes or worried about it I would say stick true to size or potentially go a size up just depending on the brands I'm probably between a zero or a two or even a four but yeah the size two on this is perfect perfect and the top of this it looks like it has padding in it but it's actually not padded but it does have a nice wire under it so if you were looking for something with a little bit more support there is that nice wire under the cup style in the front but it's not like super super padded but yeah I just think it gives such a beautiful style it is so 
so so stunning this dress is absolutely gorgeous i love all of the details on it it honestly looks way more expensive than it actually is which i love like love a good deal but yeah this dress literally 10 out of 10 i was so excited to get it and i am now so excited that i have it and i cannot wait to wear it this summer all right so that was my part two of my princess poly haul giving you guys some fun spring to summer outfit ideas some great items to add to your wardrobe as always i'll be linking everything i tried on today in my description down below i might like to know it also i do have a discount code for you guys so i'll also be leaving that discount code down below as well save some money check it out also be sure to leave a comment down below which item was your favorite which one did you like the best also if you do want that video of me styling that maxi white skirt definitely leave that in the comments as well also if you just enjoyed this style video a little review try on haul some outfit ideas be sure to give it a big thumbs up give it a like share it with your friends also if you haven't already please don't forget to subscribe i really really appreciate it and as always thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you all in the next one.